and welcome to English for You. I'm Erin. And I'm Chicklin. And today we have a new kind of article today,、oh. Chicklin, and it's similar to our TOEIC articles from、oh. the past. So it's going to be a little bit about business,、mm-hmm. but it's actually a lot more interesting and fun. Now, one thing we're going to talk about in this. In this article, is how companies advertise themselves.、Oh. Okay, so how have you seen a company advertise themselves? Well, they usually create a Facebook page、yes. or an Instagram、mm-hmm. account, so they can put all their stuff on it,、mm-hmm. and we can see it. Maybe we can shop online. Right. So lots of social media,、mm-hmm. lots of internet stuff.、Mm-hmm. You know what? Another way that I can think of is to ask famous. People、oh. like celebrities、mm-hmm. to do things for them. So one company in particular I'm thinking of is McDonald's,、Ooh. right? Because Justin Timberlake、mm-hmm. a few years ago he used to sing ba da ba ba ba. Oh yeah! And then he led to the company's slogan,、mm-hmm. which was "I'm、oh, loving、it. it." Right? <laughs> All right. So. Today, actually, what we're doing is we're talking about slogans that ba da ba ba ba. I'm, I'm loving, loving it, it. <laughs> right? Okay, it's catchy. You remember it?、Mm-hmm. Let's find out all about slogans today. Let's get started. Reading. Create your own slogan. Slogans appear everywhere. We see them on signs, on the sides of buses, in MRT stations, and in shop windows. Try writing your own slogan. Maybe one day it will be your words that people see on the street. Mike, Katie, and Dave work for a travel company called Travel for You. They are discussing the company's new slogan. Can you please give us your thoughts on what makes a good slogan? Slogans should be simple, so that people can understand and remember them. The burger shop on the corner says, "Just the right bite." This slogan is simple. I haven't forgotten it ever since I saw it. A good slogan should be direct. It should tell us what the company will do for us. The gym I go to says, "Hustle for muscle." I know what I'm getting there. I'll get a good workout, and I'll get strong. A company's slogan should also tell us how it will make our lives better. My daughter is taking online courses to learn English. Her school's website says, "Your door to the future." This slogan makes her feel like the school will change her life. It makes her feel positive. All right. Now, as you can see in the article, our article is set up a little bit differently this time. So we're going to go through each section and kind of talk to you about、Ooh. what it is, how to use、mm-hmm. it, what to write in certain places. But we're going to start out here with the introduction, and it says, "Slogans appear everywhere. We see them on signs,、mm-hmm. on the sides of buses, in MRT stations, and in shop windows." Okay, 我们来看一下这个字 slogan.、Mm-hmm. A slogan is a short and easily remembered phrase, especially one that's used to advertise a product、mm-hmm. or an idea.、Mm. 就是口号、标语的意思。那老师刚刚有说，任何地方都可以看见啊，巴士上啊 ，MRT 捷运站里面，店面的橱窗都可以看到 signs， 这些 slogans 标语。Mm-hmm. You see them everywhere.、Yeah. You also hear them everywhere、mm-hmm. too. All right. Well, here's what we're going to do. It says in the article, try writing your own slogan. Maybe one day it will be your words that people see on the street.、Mm-hmm. You never know.、Yeah. I mean, even just a simple exercise like this, maybe you'll have a good idea for a product, and <laughs>、mm-hmm. this will help you think of a slogan. And ten years from now, we'll be buying your、mm-hmm. product. Okay, so we're going to look at section number one in our article. So here it says, look at the advertisements and choose your favorite slogan. Now we do need to look at one word in there. Advertisement. It's long. You can say it a few different ways. Some people say advertisement. Some people say advertisement. Okay. Now an advertisement is something that you can read, hear, or watch that tells you about a company and the product that it wants people to buy. 
Now you can see advertisements written in magazines, newspapers, and on websites. You can also see them when you're watching TV about every 10 minutes. <laughs> oh, that's annoying.、Mm -hmm. And of course, they always play on the radio and before you watch movies. And if you're on YouTube, they cut off your YouTube video、oh. every two minutes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, here's an example. I keep seeing advertisements for car companies on Facebook because I started looking at used cars online. Okay, so advertisement 就是广告的意思 It is usually abbreviated as ad.、Yes. Ad.、Mm -hmm. We know that advertisement is a noun, and we can make it a verb by make it a verb by taking of the m e n t at the、right. end of the word.、Mm -hmm. So it 就会变成 advertise 动词哦 Now we're like, 看一个句子哦 It always costs a lot more money to advertise at peak viewing times.、Mm. 在高峰观看时间做广告要花费比较多的钱 All right, so let's find out what we're doing here. Okay,、mm -hmm. so in your magazine, you can see three pictures. There's、yeah. three pictures there for you.、Mm -hmm. Now we're going to look at the first picture, and we have a question for it. Okay. Okay. So that question is, what is the woman doing in this advertisement? Now, Chiklin, you can see the picture. What is、she's, the woman doing? She's eating a burger. It looks pretty tasty, <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Now, the magazine gives us three options for slogans.、Mm -hmm. Okay. So, slogan A option is "Happiness on a Bun." Ooh, mm, I kind of like that.、Nice. Yeah. All right. Option B. Bite into something juicy. That's not bad. That's okay.、Yeah. <laughs> And C. Just the right bite. Ooh, this one is perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So actually, three pretty good slogans there.、Mm -hmm. But before we can talk more about them, we do need to look at a second、mm -hmm. word here today, and that is juicy. Let's find out more about it. All right. We are talking about the adjective juicy here. Now, a food that's juicy has a lot of juice in it, of course. Now, here we're talking about a hamburger. If you bite into a hamburger and it is very dry and hard, you probably won't like it very much. But if this hamburger is moist and juicy, and it's got ketchup and mustard, and cheese and bacon, then it's probably just right. Nice and soft and juicy. Now, fruits, of course, are very juicy too, and that's why we have fruit juice. Here's an example. Marvin's favorite meal is a tasty, juicy steak with mashed potatoes. 好吧 ，juicy 这个字太好记了 ，juice 果汁嘛，所以加一个去掉 e， 加一个 y， 就是很多汁的，完全不用记，所以就是果汁的意思 ，juicy、mm, 很多汁。Nobody likes a dry hamburger.、No. Okay, so <laughs> we are now looking at the second picture. Okay, so the question for this picture、Ooh. is. Who would be interested in this advertisement? Okay, so what's in our picture? It's a man lifting、mm -hmm. weights. Yeah, it looks like he's in a gym. He's lifting weights. So, who would be interested in this advertisement? Maybe people like to work out. Yeah, people who like to <laughs> exercise. Maybe. I'm not one of them. Yeah,、though. exactly. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's look at the three slogan options we have. So, A is better health, better life. Okay. I like that.、Mm -hmm. B is hustle for muscle.、Mm. Okay. And C is dare to be great.、Ooh. Okay, some okay. pretty good options.、Mm -hmm. I can tell. I think you like A the best. Yeah. I think B has the nicest ring. I like the rhyme、yeah. because the word hustle and muscle they sound the same. I know.、Mm. I personally don't really like the word hustle. Okay. It makes me feel like I'm doing something that's tough. Ah. You know, hustle means to act energetically,、mm -hmm. aggressively, or rapidly.、Mm -hmm. Yeah, go fast, go, 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 go,
happen if you do it. Now, the reason we say dare to be great is that it's often easy in daily life to become lazy and not really care about fitness.、Yeah. Now, gyms know this about us,、mm -hmm. so they tell us to dare to go to the <laughs> gym and change the way you live your life.、Mm -hmm. All right, here's another example. Janelle's little brother quickly climbed up the tall tree, but she wouldn't dare. 好，那 dare 就是胆敢的意思，敢不敢啊？敢不敢？ Dare could be used in two ways. Oh, two ways as an ordinary verb and as an auxiliary verb. 可以当一般动词或者是助动词哦。那么当一般动词的时候呢， dare is followed by the infinitive with to. 好，那我们来造一个句子哦。He dares to say what's on his mind. Or she didn't dare to tell the truth, and as an auxiliary verb, dare is followed by an infinitive without to. 它就没有 to 喽。好，那我们来看一下第二个句子。He dares say what's on his mind, 或者 she dare not tell the truth. And the word dare is not that commonly used in modern English. We usually use other expressions to express the same meaning. And for the sentences we just made, we can simply say, "He is not afraid to say what is on what's on his mind." 那我们一般动词的这个 dare 呢，它其实比起助动词这个 dare 还老来的比较常用一点哦。所以我们常常就会说 "Don't you dare." 或者是 you dare to tell someone angrily not to do something. For example, you can say, "I'm going to tell him what you said." 然后你就很生气的可以说 "Don't you dare!" 你敢你就惨了 So we've been through the two pictures. So we've been through two pictures.、Mm -hmm. There was the first one with the girl eating the burger. Second one with the man eating or、oh, eating lifting weights, weights, lifting <laughs> weights. <laughs> yeah, lifting weights, not eating weights. Now we have a third picture, and we have a question for、Ooh. it. The question is, what type of company do you think this is? Now, in our picture, we can see a girl using a laptop, using a laptop, a computer at a desk.、Mm -hmm. So, what type of company would we think this is? Well, I think it should be a place for learning. Obviously, yep.、Mm -hmm. um, and she, the girl in the picture, she looks quite young. So maybe、mm -hmm. a young student.、Yeah. So maybe some type of school.、Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's look at our three options. Option A. Your door to the future.、Mm. Okay. Oh, oh, hello, future. <laughs> All right. Option B. Make learning fun. I like that one. Okay. It's nice and simple. <laughs> and option C. Building your child's <gasps> success. No, this one is a little stressful. It's hard to say too. Building your child's success. Too many S's.、Yeah. Well, Chicklin. We're not going to find out quite yet、mm -hmm. which slogans they've used. Yeah.、Um, quite soon, but、mm -hmm. first we're going to get to section number two.、Ooh. Now, section number two says, "What do you think about the slogan you chose?" Okay, so now we're going to have to find out, like, kind of which、mm -hmm. ones you liked. Okay, so which ones did you like? You mean all of them?、Mm, yeah. Well, I tend to I tend to choose the one that make me feel good、okay. about myself, or、okay. that put me in a good mood.、Ah, so no, like、mm. the first one, just the right bite. Just the right bite. I mean,、perfect. when I take a bite, it、mm -hmm. makes me feel right. Yes, I、And、like that. The word "perfect" good for company、mm -hmm. slogan. Yes.、Mm -hmm. What about you? You know what? I really liked the one "hustle for muscle." <laughs> oh yeah. I really like that "hustle for muscle." What I hustle? Give me some muscle. <laughs> All right. Well. We are going to find out、mm -hmm. what makes a good slogan.、Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's kind of what ha is happening next. Now、yeah. there are a few questions we can ask about the slogans、mm -hmm. we like. Okay, so think of your favorite slogan. Okay, here's the first question: Is it easy to understand? Just the right bite. Definitely, like a restaurant、mm -hmm. or. Like a food, yeah, something related to exactly. food. Exactly, it just makes it. It makes you think yeah, of perfect food. Yeah, it's I think、nice、it's simple. pretty clear. Yeah. Okay. So,、um, hustle for, for mine, hustle for muscle. Yeah. Clear, yeah. Yeah. I know what it means. I mean, you're gonna gain muscles. Work hard for yeah. muscles. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Keep your favorite slogan in your head again.、Mm -hmm. Does it make it clear what the company is selling? Ooh.、Mm -hmm. Pretty just, clear, but、mm -hmm. just selling food. Not、just、sure what type of food. Food in general, not necessarily a burger,、mm -hmm. right? Hustle for muscle. It's pretty clear. Bigger muscles.、Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So your favorite slogan again? Does it make me feel good about myself? Just the right bite. Yeah. Yeah. Just a little. It puts me in a good mood. Like、yeah. I'm going to eat. 
Good. The good food you、uh-huh. want to eat.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, could be. I mean, it doesn't have to be a burger. Could be just the right bite of、um, sandwich. Sandwich. <laughs> Vegetarian sandwich.、Uh-huh. Who knows? Um, does hustling for muscles Kinda make me、like、feel good? For Subway. Yeah, maybe, maybe a little bit. <laughs> All right. Well, okay. So the three questions、mm-hmm. we ask are: Is it simple?、Mm-hmm. Does it make you feel good about yourself? And does it make, make it clear, clear what the company、mm-hmm. is selling? So、yeah. those are the three things we need to look for、mm-hmm. in a good slogan. Now, section number three.、Mm-hmm. It says here: Listen and write down the slogans. Okay, so we're gonna meet some people in our article now. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna have to leave our slogans behind.、Mm-hmm. Now we're gonna meet Mike, Katie, and Dave. Okay. Great、okay? people. Yeah. So it says here, Mike, Katie, and Dave work for a travel company called Travel for <laughs> You.、Hmm. Okay. They are discussing the company's new slogan, the new slogan for travel for you.、Mm-hmm. Okay, now we have a word in that sentence we need to discuss. So let's discuss it now. All right, let's talk about the verb discuss. Now, when you discuss, you talk with another person or a group of people to get ideas about something or to exchange information between you. You could also go into a meeting with one idea you already have and talk about that idea and why it might be good or bad. Here's another example. I'd like to discuss some of my ideas with you. Can we talk after lunch? How is it discussed? Just a 讨论的意思 The noun form is discussion.、Mm-hmm. 那我们就会用啊 to have a discussion about or on or over something、mm-hmm. 来表示讨论某事哦那我们来造一个句子吧 The students had a discussion over various topics in class. That sounds like a good class.、Mm-hmm. Lots of learning. <laughs> All right. So here is another question, and you can see that in the magazine, there's another kind of little head of a person、mm-hmm. asking this question, and it、mm-hmm. asks, "Can you please give us your thoughts on what makes a good slogan?" Okay. Now this time they're not asking for my thoughts.、Mm-hmm. They're asking for Katie、mm-hmm. and Mike and. Dave. Dave. Yes. Okay. okay. So let's start with Katie. So Katie thinks slogans should be simple so that people can understand and remember、mm-hmm. them. I agree with her. Me too. Simple.、Yeah. Your slogan. If your slogan is ten words long, nobody nobody's gonna... ever gonna say it. Yeah. It's、no. too long, right? So she continues to say, "The burger shop on the corner says." Just the right bite. <laughs>、mm, okay. I think you made a good choice there, Chikling. <laughs> All right. So, just the right bite. Four words. Good idea.、Mm-hmm. Simple idea. That's why Katie says, "This slogan is simple. I haven't forgotten it ever since I saw it." It's really hard to forget it. Yeah, it's so easy to remember. Just <laughs>、yeah. the right bite, right?、Mm-hmm. And it has right and bite,、mm-hmm. and they rhyme, and rhymes are great. Yeah. Okay, so that's what she thinks about just the right bite.、Mm-hmm. Here's Dave. Dave says a good slogan should be direct. It should tell us what the company will do for us. Okay.、Um, do you agree with him? Yes. Yeah, I do. I- Kind of. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So direct 这个字为什么要用这个字呢？它就是呃，没有人，就是很直接的意思。Mm-hmm. When there is nothing, or there is nothing in between.、Mm-hmm. And if somebody is direct, maybe if I am direct,、mm-hmm. I tend to say something in a very honest way、mm-hmm. without worrying about other people's opinions.、Mm-hmm. 就是非常直接。所以 Dave 觉得说呢，标语应该越直接越好。So, let's see what the company is doing. No, I think what the Dave is trying to say here is you don't want it to be a confusing slogan. Yeah, you don't want it to be ambiguous. Yeah. yeah, so it's got to kind of get that point in there.、Mm-hmm. So he continues. He says, "The gym I go to says hustle for muscle." Uh huh. There we go. <laughs> we both made good choices.、Mm-hmm. We make made a good choice here. Now, what is a gym? A gym is a special building or large room that has equipment for exercising, such as treadmills. That's where you run on the machine. Standing bicycles <laughs> and, of course, weights. Yeah. Right. 
好，就健身房的意思嘛，所以大家应该都会去健身房吧。It also means physical activities、mm-hmm. or exercises that are that are performed inside,、mm-hmm. often using equipment.、Mm-hmm. 所以也可以当体操啊，呃，体育的意思。所以像我们学校上体育课，其实你就可以说 The sixth graders have gym on Fridays.、Mm, basketball.、Mm-hmm. All right. Well, Dave continues. He says. I know what I'm getting there. I'll get a good workout, and、mm. I'll get strong.、Ooh. So hustle for muscle, good workout, get strong. That makes sense. Very、mm-hmm. direct. Okay, so workout 就是运动、健身的意思，在这边当名词。那么当动词的时候就分开写就好了。所以 if you somebody that's really fit, you、mm-hmm. can say, "Do you work out?"、Mm. or "You must work out a lot." Right. <laughs> Okay, now let's find out what Mike thinks about、mm-hmm. the slogans. It says a company slogan should also tell us how it will make our lives better.、Mm-hmm. That's a that makes、yeah. sense. How is it going to make my life better? Now he gives the example. My daughter is taking online courses to learn English. Her school's website says. Your door to the future. Okay.、Mm. Hi, future. Again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So online 这个字就是在线上的意思。那么相反 ，offline 就是离线的，不在线上的。所以 Mike 觉得一个公司的标语应该要表现出它怎么可以让我们的生活更好、更棒。嗯、mm-hmm. 哼。Now, why does his daughter like this slogan?、Mm-hmm. It says here, this slogan makes her feel like the school will change her life. It、okay. makes her feel positive. Okay. All right. So if a slogan makes you feel positive, that's even better.、Mm-hmm. Positive is this adjective that describes when you feel like you believe good things will happen or that a bad situation is going to get better.、Mm-hmm. Like this example. I'm feeling positive today. I know we had a bad day yesterday, but I think today will be better. Yeah, it's just like、um, optimistic. Yeah, like you're optimistic about things.、Mm-hmm. You're positive. Just right. 乐观啊，正向的意思 And the antonym is negative,、mm. 负面的，不好的 Okay, so Mike 的女儿有在线上，就像上英文课啦。那线上课课程的网站的标语是。通向未来的门 That sounds actually pretty good. Yeah. For me, maybe I'm gonna change my mind. <laughs> door to the future. It's like, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna give me confidence、mm-hmm. and hello, future. 对，那这样子，像说这个 positive， 它除了当可以非常正向 ，it also means without any doubt、mm-hmm. or certain when you're、right. certain about something. 所以，譬如说。Mm-hmm. I'm absolutely positive that he stole money from his dad. Uh oh, that's not a positive way to end. No. All right. Okay, guys. So today we've seen three different slogans. Why they were chosen?、Mm-hmm. Why people think they were good? We are not finished talking about slogans yet, though. We'll be back to we'll be back tomorrow with more talk about slogans. But for now, stay tuned, and we'll be right back to talk more about this article. Okay, Chiklin. Is there anything else you think a slogan should be besides simple, direct, and positive? And can you come up with your own? Maybe.、Uh, well, for me,、mm-hmm. I think my slogan、mm-hmm. would be pretty creative. Okay, creative. I, I will want it to be fun.、Mm-hmm. So when people see it, they're a Pretty surprised,、mm. and they're they're like seeing something new they've、right? never seen it before. So maybe they're l- they're they're kind of like, oh yeah, yeah oh. this one is good. So、I、a、like、little、that. bit of surprise,、mm-hmm. maybe something funny、mm-hmm. in it, like、mm-hmm. a kind of have like a little funny joke in it,、mm-hmm. yeah. like a, a punchline. Mm, maybe.、Yeah. <laughs> Now, if I was gonna come up with、um, mm-hmm. a product, maybe、okay. let's say I open up a French fry shop. Okay, <gasps> maybe my slogan could be "Fries for Life." I don't know. I don't know.、Oh, that's short.、Okay. It tells people what I'm selling. It's easy to remember.、Mm-hmm. Maybe it feels makes them feel good about themselves. I think I'll visit your restaurant. Okay, fries、frequently. for life.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like these, that. These will these French fries will give you life.、Mm-hmm. All right.、Fries、well, <laughs> all right. Well, I just came up with my own. You guys go talk about it and come up with your own, and then come、mm-hmm. back here tomorrow to learn more. Okay. Bye bye. Bye. Create your own slogan. Slogans appear everywhere. We see them on signs, on the sides of buses, in MRT stations, and in shop windows. Try writing your own slogan. 
Maybe one day it will be your words that people see on the street. Mike, Katie, and Dave work for a travel company called Travel for You. They are discussing the company's new slogan. Can you please give us your thoughts on what makes a good slogan? Slogans should be simple, so that people can understand and remember them. The burger shop on the corner says, "Just the right bite." This slogan is simple. I haven't forgotten it ever since I saw it. A good slogan should be direct. It should tell us what the company will do for us. The gym I go to says, "Hustle for muscle." I know what I'm getting there. I'll get a good workout and I'll get strong. A company's slogan should also tell us how it will make our lives better. My daughter is taking online courses to learn English. Her school's website says, "Your door to the future." This slogan makes her feel like the school will change her life. It makes her feel positive. Vocabulary review. Advertisement. The magazine contained many advertisements for different products. Juicy. The pears I bought at the grocery store this morning are so juicy. Dare. None of the kids dared to go into that old house at midnight. Discuss. The manager called Erica into his office and said he had something to discuss. Gym. Mitch goes to the gym at least twice a week in order to stay healthy. Positive. Lowry's teacher gave him many positive comments about his article. 智慧小补帖 Slogan. Workout. The program is produced by Huo Yong Kongzhong Mei Yu. Huo Yong Kongzhong Mei Yu Magazine. Please look for it in all major bookstores. If you want to purchase the magazine, please call 02-2364-4000. 02-2364-4000. www.dot.english.cu.dot.net.